lighting in accommodation units can account for up to 25% of their total electricity consumption. However, hoteliers can rely on the wide range of energy efficient lamps available on the market to save energy and reduce costs. For example, compact fluorescent lamps can easily replace the traditional tungsten light bulbs used in standard light fittings. As these lamps consume 75% less energy and last 8 to 10 times longer than tungsten light bulbs, they are a cost effective lighting option. Energy efficient lamps should also be used in high output applications such as the metal halide and high pressure sodium lamps that often are used in gardens and other outdoor areas. Motion sensors which turn lights on as people approach can be used either indoors or outdoors. These are simple to install and can save a lot of energy when used to control lights in areas that often remain unoccupied for long periods of time. Photo cells which are designed to turn lights on only when there's insufficient natural light are another good example of effective energy conservation devices. Notwithstanding these measures, it's equally important to assess the amount of lighting provided. Excessive lighting is wasteful, even when the light fittings are equipped with energy efficient lamps. Accommodation units should refrain from providing more light than needed, limit the amount of decorative lighting used, and turn all positive decorative lights off when the guests are asleep. It's not just lighting which can benefit from having automatic controls. Other electrical equipment can be controlled by timing devices to ensure they only run when necessary. Jacuzzi pumps can be controlled by electronic or wind-up timers to ensure they switch off after an appropriate time. Similarly, the pumps driving these pool features are designed to turn off after a few minutes, again reducing power consumption. Even if energy efficient equipment and systems have been installed, common sense should be exercised when they are operated. Accommodation units often leave a surprisingly large number of lights, air conditioning units and other appliances on unnecessarily. In order to save energy and extend the service life of the equipment, you should train your staff to turn off all lights and equipment that are not needed. This rule applies equally to public areas and back of house areas such as kitchens, laundries, mechanical rooms, storerooms and offices.